going on YouTube? This is my Champions Digivolve. This is my new YouTube channel. Got some wonderful things that we got planned for this, this channel. We're going to kick off things with this Pokemon Go Nuzlocke right here. We're getting the game started right now. Got the character all set up. We're going to catch our first Pokemon. Now here's the rules. The rules of a Nuzlocke can only catch one Pokemon per route. That's the normal Nuzlocke rules. Well, Pokemon Go, you can only catch one one Pokemon per town that you go to. So I'm going to have to do some traveling throughout the series to try and catch a bunch of different Pokemon. Our starter is going to be given up. We're going to catch this first Pokemon. We got to go with our boy. We got to go with the, the Charmander right off the bat. We catch this one. We're going to have to right trade him out. And we're going to catch the first random Pokemon that we can. Uh, we're going to make, make these choices. Now, every episode, I have to battle a gym. Uh, if I lose the gym, Pokemon, Pokemon faints. I have to release that Pokemon. I cannot catch that Pokemon again. Uh, any Pokemon I catch per town is open to be caught anywhere in the world. Uh, in order to to build up the candies and evolve our Pokemon so we can be successful. We gotta catch that same Pokemon, but we're only limited to the ones that we've caught. So here we go. I'm gonna name our character, and you know how it goes. Champion. There it is. Guess my name's taken. So it's gonna be my champion's Digivolved. Well, the champion's Digi it is. Pokemon Go doesn't want to cooperate with me today. So what we got to do is we're going to go gonna go around, we're going to catch different Pokemon. We're allowed one per town. Now we're kicking off this game, starting out in, in a town. The first Pokemon that I catch here, I cannot catch any other Pokemon. I'm allowed to catch that type, that Pokemon specifically in its evolution line, and that's it. Pokemon faints, it's done. I can't catch it no more. I can't catch multiple Pokemon per town. I'm not running the, the rules of you can catch one Pokemon per Pokestop. We're doing one per town, very similar to how you would run a Nuzlocke on the games. So, we're kicking it off. We're starting this up during the Halloween event. We got a few gyms in the area. We got a few Pokemon that we, could th we can choose from. Looks like right now we got Ghastly and Nidoran. So first off, what we gotta do is we have to transfer out that Charmander. I think uh, Pokemon we're going to go with today, considering outside of the Halloween events, it seems like Ghastly doesn't really appear all that much. We're going to go with Nidoran. Back playing red and blue. Used to love getting a Nidoking. Used to be one of my favorites growing up. Pokemon Go is, has really been a way for for you know, myself to, to reconnect with my childhood. You know, I grew up playing red and blue and yellow and all those other wonderful games. And they were, they were a lot of fun. So, we can only catch Nidorants right now. Um, we'll start off the gym, the gym battle challenges in each and every episode when I've obtained six different Pokemon. Uh, 
makes everything everything fair. We go and look at the gym right here. Which I can't access right now. And here we go. We're we're kicking off the, the Halloween event. Professor Willow here is gonna lay me down, run me down with how the event is gonna run. Gonna give me all my new uh, research. Let's see, I've got two available. We've got a spooky message unmasked. Catch 30 ghost type Pokemon. Transfer four Pokemon. Catch 34 Pokemon. Catch 30 Pokemon for investigate a mysterious energy. Spin 30 Pokestops or gyms. And send 10 gifts to friends. Now listen. I'll be I'll be posting my my trainer code on the description. Feel free, everybody, add me. You know, make it a we'll make this a fun time. So we're gonna talk about investigating vaults right now. going to give us the rundown on the new mega evolutions that are running through Pokemon Go right now. Pokemon Go has been uh, a bit bit different during this whole this whole trying time. Uh, we got some special bonuses. We can open up 1.5 as many times as many uh, gifts. Uh, we can join the battle league. Without a walking requirement, we get boosted damage uh, in remote raids, two times incense duration. And then we got our our Halloween event. Get double the candies when we catch Pokemon, which is going to be great because we want to get we want to get up our uh, squad right now, so we could start taking on some gyms. We're also going to get into battles we're gonna do the trainer battles get into some online battling we'll incorporate that in to the the nuzlocke you know you lose the pokemon they're gone let's see we got our shop we got our bonus you know our one time one time bonus for checking out a pokestop and we're getting a daily free box uh, Another rule to this this Nuzlocke you cannot buy any in-game items. We're going 100% free to play uh, adds another little level of difficulty. Um, eggs, Pokemon that we catch, Pokemon that we hatch from eggs are null and void. We can't use them. One per town. Town, city, we only get one. So eggs, eggs don't do us much good. We have to release any and all eggs that we do hatch. Um, so our plan is going to be to go out. We're gonna go around. We're gonna travel around. I'm gonna take you guys on this adventure. This. This Pokemon Go Nuzlocke adventure that we're starting today. We're gonna catch hopefully a, a bunch of Nidorans during our time. Uh, every time we go into a new town, we're gonna catch a new Pokemon. That's the plan for this series. We're gonna go into a new town every single day. We're gonna catch us a new Pokemon. We're gonna you know, engage in battles when we got six. And we can we can actually compete. Um, this also adds a, a level of difficulty because we're not catching every wild Pokemon that we see. We're not getting all that experience. 
so we're going to be really limited to gaining experience through things like our battles and things like that. So we have to really be on point. Uh, I'm also going to be calling out for name suggestions for our Pokemon. We got this this boy right here, Nidoran. You know, needs a name suggestion. Leave it down in the comments. Let me know what you guys think. The, the series is going to progress when when we reach level 40 we win the Nuzlocke either that or we lose all, all of our Pokemon and then essentially we're out there is no also there is no shiny cause there will be no shiny cause we run into a shiny we can't catch it We got a Dust Skull, we got a Ghastly here, Drifloom just popped up. So this is what we're gonna do. We're gonna go out. Let me show you guys the character. This is my champion. Right here. Got Nidoran as our buddy. Get some candies. Get him to level up a little bit. Get him a little stronger so we can start competing. But this is our boy right here. This is my champions, Digivolt. Right here, we're rocking the pandemic mask and the Galarian outfit. And we're, we're ready to go on this adventure. I don't know if you guys are excited about this adventure as well. Please leave a comment, like, subscribe, let me know what you guys think. Ah, look at that, our boy's already popping up with some gifts. You know, all feedback is greatly appreciated. You know, trying to find find new, new things to do. We're going to do some wonderful things with this channel. Uh, we're going to do some... some some hacks, some hack games. We're gonna do uh, some run-throughs of, of some classics. We're gonna get into some of the newer newer games. Uh, Sword and Shield. They just dropped just dropped the new the new expansion pack for Sword and Shield. Uh, Pokemon Go is highlighting that right now. We got new hats, Crown Tundra helmet. We got, we got new shirts, new outfits, the Count Crown Tundra uniform. I think our boy might need some glasses. What do y'all think? What do y'all think? think? That might be something we need to work up to. They got they got new bags. All kicking off the Crown Tundra release for Pokemon Sword and Shield. But we got our guy, he's decked out. We got the mega bracelet, Galarian hat, top, bottom. We got the, the Zoro haircut right now. Walking around with our mask. We're gonna be walking around, you know, visiting different Poke Stops. I'm gonna take you guys on on the adventure. It ought to be a good time. And, you know, if you guys are excited, I'm just ex just as excited too. This is gonna be a great time. You know, we're gonna I'm gonna tweak the rules as we go. You know, I did a lot of research into any any Pokemon Go Nuzlocke rules. But he's really done it. There's been some here and there. Um, I feel like some of the rules with, you know, you get a new Pokemon every Poke stop. It, it just seems a little excessive. It, seem, it seems like the challenge is not there. You know, um, I think that 
know, to keep the challenge alive, it should be one per town. So that's that's the rules that I'm gonna go with. I'm gonna go with one Pokemon per town that I venture into. See how it goes. Uh, see if we can either win this, we can lose this. Uh, if you guys have any rule suggestions about how we win the win the Nuzlocke, uh, let me know. Um, Pokemon caught in special research events. So the only clause to the rule is the special Pokemon we get at the end of these special research events. So the special research events that gave us Mew, Celebi, Those are, those are the Pokemon that we are going to be able to catch and keep and use. Um, that and Pokemon that are caught from uh, special raids. Uh, those are going to be a little harder to catch, specifically going off the Nuzlocke. We're going to be we're going to be backed against the corner. So if we can beat Pokemon like Mewtwo or Giratina, or who do we got here right now? Uh, we got a. We got all the mega evolution raids that are going on right now. If we're able to catch those, we're able to win those raids, then I think we, I think we deserve those Pokemon. Once we catch a Pokemon once, they're free to catch anywhere we are uh, and catch as many as we can. Uh, let's see what we got for news. Also new events coming up in Pokemon Go. We got familiar faces return to raids, new features, updates, and more. Familiar faces return to raids, new features, updates, and more. Learn about what's happening in the world of Pokemon Go in the November blog. That doesn't really tell us a whole lot now, does it? But I'm really excited about this. They're, they're releasing Galarian forms. And they're also bringing out Surfetched to Pokemon Go. Catch a Farfetch'd. What you gotta do... 10 excellent throws with Galarian Farfetch'd as your buddy, and you'll be able to evolve him into this, this guy right here, Sir Fetched. They're also introducing Galarian Ponyta and Galarian Rapidash. I know they've already put out Obstagoon, they put out Galarian Meowth, uh, and a bunch of other forms which have been really, really awesome to see. So I'm excited for this. I'm excited for being able to, to go out, bring you guys along with me, do this Nuzlocke. Um, I plan on posting videos like this every single day, seven days a week putting out these these Pokemon Go episodes until either we win or we lose. You know, this is this is our buddy. You know you guys leave a leave a name suggestion down in the comments for me. I'll make sure that I pick names out of the comments. You know, I'm, I'm new to YouTube. You know, this, this first video seems a bit janky, but I'll get into the hang of it, get into the swing of things, and really make this experience you know, really great for everybody. I'm gonna try and have as much fun. I'm gonna try and bring as much fun to you. You guys out there, you guys watching this, you guys looking into this, you guys, you know, wanting to play along, absolutely. I'll include my trainer code in the description. You send me a friend request. 
we'll get cracking. It'd be great. You know, we'll do some some Pokemon battles. We'll we'll do some some wonderful stuff. You guys can play right along with me. I'll follow along with the Nuzlocke. I'll leave the rules in the description. So leave a like. Give me a shout out. Tell me what I can improve. Tell me if you guys like the series. You guys don't like the series. Check me out. Uh, we're going to be doing some wonderful stuff on this channel, like I was saying. You know, we're going to do some giveaways. We're going to do some, some playthroughs. We're going to do some new stuff. We're going to do some, some randomizers. We're going to do some nuzlocks. We're, we're going to get, we're going to get it. We're also going to do, uh, Digimon games. You know, we're going to, we're going to get into the Digimon world games things like that we're gonna go through those uh, some some hacks and and things like that that are a lot of fun to play we're gonna hopefully make this this a a, a great thing now I'm looking forward to, to feedback comments you know, if you guys are looking for something for me to do specifically you want to see uh, I got some things in the works looking at some different different hacks uh, I've been looking at Pokemon Gaia uh, Pokemon Brown uh, got something special lined up for Christmas time uh, Digimon Fire Red version you know we'll we'll do some we'll do some fun stuff with that do some playthroughs and some Nuzlocke's and you know have a good time so um, if you guys like the video, please like, subscribe, leave me a, leave me a comment, tell me what's up, tell me how I can improve, tell me what you guys like, but I'm the champions Digivolved, y'all be safe, stay healthy, stay happy, see you in the next one, bye.